He's loitering with intent. For months, Sean Boswell has been hanging around tube stations, hoping to recruit enough musicians for his 12-12-12 challenge, which hopes to form an orchestra that will perform and raise money for charity. Excuse me, sorry to bother you, is that a musical instrument? Yes. It's called 12-12-12 because the final performance will be on the 12th of December 2012. So we started on the 1st of January and I have uh, until the 12th of December to perform and form the orchestra. There are self-imposed rules that the East Londoner must follow when recruiting. He must not know the musicians personally, they must be carrying their musical instruments when he meets them, and they must meet inside the London Sorry, Underground. Um, am I right in thinking that's a, is either a violin or a ukulele? It's a violin. It yeah. is a violin, excellent. That was exactly so right. are some stations better than others for trying to recruit? Yeah, you, but the ones that are the best are going to be the ones where you've got orchestras rehearsing or musical colleges. So Baker Street's a good one. Um, Greenwich is a good one for Trinity College, but I'm still, like I was saying, in debate whether DLR stations count on the Underground Challenge. So you could cheat, really. You could just recruit buskers from any station, couldn't you? Yeah, just I've kind of excluded buskers from it for that reason. Uh, the entire point is it's kind of meeting people at random, very much by chance. Sean, a musician himself, hopes to recruit up to 100 people. Last night on the EDF London Eye, he performed a warm-up performance with some of those already on board. I thought it was a very, very cool, interesting, novel idea and, uh, and yeah, and got back in touch with him and, uh, and have been more or very keen to get involved with, with the whole process since then. I never felt nervous so far, but maybe starting the feel for today is because it's getting so close. <laughs> There's another warm-up gig to raise awareness on Friday at the Union Chapel in Islington. That's ahead of the grand underground orchestra performance at a yet-to-be-disclosed London venue on the 12th of December. Until then, Sean continues his search. Brendan Manus, BBC London News.